and bad, in sickness and in health. I promise to love you and touch only your nipples for all the days of my life. I now pronounce you husband and wife. The bride may now touch the groom's nipples. Oh, Jesus! God, no! Greg! 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 What is she doing here? Greg, I am so sorry. I made a huge mistake. Sharon, it's too late. But you didn't even let me explain myself. Who is this woman? She's an ex. It was a long time ago we've been broken up. I know you. You're the woman who hurt my Greg very deeply. <laughs> <laughs> Please, you've got to believe me. That night at the annual Nipple Appreciation Festival, I wasn't touching anyone's nipples. I was just appreciating them. <laughs> Miss, I'm sorry. You must excuse yourself from the wedding ceremony. That was just a friend. He asked me to pluck a little nipple hair right before you went on stage for the nipple beauty pageant, and his nipples meant nothing to me. Nothing. Couldn't even wax his own nipples. Am I right, Greg? <laughs> <laughs> he had already waxed his nipples, but there was a tiny little hair that didn't get waxed, and I had to pluck it with tweezers while he stretched his nipple out with both of his hands. Oh, here. <laughs> oh, my here. God. So it was just a misunderstanding. Uh-huh. And you, are you really ready to commit yourself to this man's nipples for the rest of your life? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Once you touch his nipples, that is it. You are a married woman. <laughs> are you really ready to commit yourself <laughs> for, for an eternity? How dare you, lady? You've gone too far. <laughs> Frank, what are you going to do? Wait, what about me? I'm ready. I love his nipples. I'm ready to dedicate my entire life to nipples. <laughs> Greg, are you going to let me touch your nipples? Or are you going to run off this nipple whore and your friend's nipple hair? Greg, okay, please, give me one more chance. Your nipples are the only nipples that I have ever loved. It's too late. Look at me. I'm already in my best shirt with the big holes cut out for my nipples. <laughs> I've dreamed of this day since I was a little boy. If only my parents could see me now. But they're dead. You know what? I'm done. I'm not going to get married today. What? Greg, she's right. I'm not ready to dedicate myself to one man's nipples. Not when there are so many amazing nipples out there. Right? I mean, just think about it. All the different colors, different shapes, different elasticities. I mean, I have my whole life ahead of me, and I'm not going to waste it on one set of nipples. His nipples are all yours, girl. Treat them well. <laughs> Shall we start over?